Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Christy and as you can tell, I'm back outside on the deck. It is 76 degrees in Tennessee. It feels like spring and I'm so happy to not be filming inside anymore. Not sure how the lighting's gonna be. You guys would rather have me out here, I'm sure, than in the house or in my office. So, filming will resume outside from now on, weather permitting. Today's video is in collaboration with Elizabeth, Countess of Low Carb. She has an amazing YouTube channel and I watch her for all my keto and intermittent fasting needs. I watch her for research. I have a handful of people I always watch to get all my information, but she is my absolute favorite. She is amazing. She's in Virginia. She's a Southern girl just like me. Make sure you check her out. She is doing a video on the best Dollar Tree keto items to pick up. Keto for one dollar at Dollar Tree. I'm so pumped to see that video and see what I need to be picking up. She has lost over 67 pounds on her journey and she has helped me to lose over 20 in one month on mine. So make sure you check her out. She'll be in the description and in the link above my little head. Check her out and make sure you see that video and tell her I sent you. This is a huge haul today, so go ahead and get comfortable. I'm excited to show you. I had so many new things that are my favorites that you guys are gonna be blown away. Follow me on Instagram, and if you didn't see the come with me to the Dollar Tree that this goes with, I'll have it linked for you guys too, up here, down here, everywhere. Okay, follow me on Instagram. Let's go ahead and get started. One of my absolute favorite finds this time was the floral Forager, a seasonal journal collected from nature. Oh my gosh, look at this book. And it's a journal. Let's look at the pages, you'll be amazed. Here's the inside cover, it's like this in the front and the back. And then you just have your lined pages and nature pictures on each one of them. Look at that, is that not amazing? It doesn't say how many pages it is, but this retails in the U.S. for $16.95. $16. It also has your little burgundy piece right here, your little ribbon, so wherever you stop writing in this journal, you can just place it there, and you know exactly where to come back to when you're ready to start writing again. This would be perfect for Mother's Day, for any holiday, um, for birthdays, a wedding gift. This is just an amazing little book. They had several. I only bought one and I saved the rest for you guys, so make sure you get out there and find them. Now, my other favorite find this time were all the new masks they had out. I'm huge into skincare. I've been slacking lately, but I have reordered everything that I'd ran out of. That was the problem. I'm just too lazy to order. But they had in some hydro gel masks and I picked them both up. This one is, well, they're all from Global Beauty Care. This one is the cucumber and it is your hydro gel under eye pads. So you just take them out of the package and you put them right here and you leave these on for about 10 to 15 minutes. It says that it is soothing, it's a 15 minutes eye therapy and it eases a puffiness and swelling and you get one treatment in this. The other one is for your lips. So. This one is the collagen based hydro gel lip mask and it is an anti-aging serum. Again, it's a 15 to 10 minute mask that you put on and it's supposed to revive skin elasticity. So probably I should put this all over my face. It is supposed to help firm and tone. Definitely needs to go all over my face. Then the other two that they had were foot masks. So I'm gonna assume they have little booties in them. Here they are. We got a red one and a green one. The green one is a moisturizing foot mask. It softens cracked heels and rough dry feet, moisturizes and exfoliates, exfoliates and it's convenient wearable mask socks. 
This is also a mask socks. This one is exfoliating though. So it peels away dead skin cells, exfoliates, and moisturizes. I can't wait to try these. When I do, I will probably post some pictures on Instagram and give a review there. So make sure you're following me on Instagram for those reviews. Okay, check this DIY banner out. Are you serious? Look at that. This was in the party supply section, but this is something that you can use year round for any occasion. This would be great for weddings, bridal showers, birthdays if you're going for a theme like this. This would be great for seasonal decor, for spring, for fall. It is a seven foot banner. It is burlap and the string is twine and you get six of the little triangles on here. Is that not adorable? There are so many things that you could do with this. So many DIYs. I can't wait to see what everybody posts on their Dollar Tree DIYs with this. This, if you picked up at Michael's, you would pay more than a dollar for it. So I was happy to find it there. They did have another one that was a rustic farmhouse type theme. It's on the come with me to the Dollar Tree video. So make sure you watch it if you wanna see what it looks like. What else did I pick up? They had some Bolero. And you know I've got issues with the Bolero face wipes. I absolutely adore these. You get 30 and this one has got such a pretty package. It is the coconut and rose oil facial wipes. What I do with these is I'll take one out and at night I'll put just a little bit of warm water on it, just a drop or two. And then my facial cleanser. I'll take the little wipe and I'll rub it together and get it good and sudsy. And then I'll just wash my entire face. This saves my washcloths they don't get nasty and all this gunk all over them and these last me about a month i absolutely adore them now my 17 year old daughter she uses them by herself by themselves just to take her makeup off and she says they work great and of course if you guys have seen her her face is flawless she doesn't have you know any um irritation or rash or acne from them they we both do have pretty sensitive skin and at dollar tree this is one of our favorite facial cleansing wipes. So make sure you're looking for the new Bolero. I think they have two or three new scents in. I think one of them is hibiscus. It's in the pink. And although the packaging is gorgeous, I'm not as crazy about the scent as I am with that one. Speaking of my 17 year old, I did pick up her some more items at the Dollar Tree and this was one of them. This is the Revlon Color Silk Glowing Blonde Color Stay nourishing wait for it conditioner remember a while back they had in all the shampoos in all the colors i did pick up the shampoo in the red and the blonde for both of my girls but now they have in the conditioner but they've only got it in blonde so far so i went ahead and picked up two of those kerrigan will just use them on the tips of her hair well it's like blonde from here down at this point but she doesn't moisturize up here, only on the very ends, so they don't get dry and brittle. So she can use this. This is 8.45 ounces of conditioner. I think I've mentioned this before. The color that comes out is like a blonde color. Probably can't see, but I know when uh, Briley uses the one that's in red, oh my gosh, the shower looks like someone, it, it looks like Psycho in there. I mean, there's red everywhere. It doesn't dye the shower, so it washes right down, but just so you know. And also, if you look at these on the website, it says that they're not just for color treated hair. They can be used on natural blonde hair or whatever color you pick up so we like these they do not dry her hair out she has naturally extremely oily hair anyways kerrigan does so these have been great for her and they have in some new la colors makeup tons of new makeups which were in the come with me to the dollar tree but i only picked up this one because kerrigan is obsessed with makeup and she is extremely adventurous when it comes to her eyes and they had in the metallic liquid liners with the fine tip brush these are high impact colors and this one is the metallic lavender they did have it in three other colors besides this one and also a matte black and do you know how hard it is to find a matte black i probably should have picked it up because i can't find mine anywhere i don't know if kerrigan has snagged it from me or what but the brand that I use, I think, is either Stila or Kat Von D. I've got both. Can't find either one of them. So I probably should have picked one of these up in a matte black because I'm just rocking the mascara. 
but she will be trying this out and I will let you guys know or I will put a picture on Instagram of her eye makeup with that. I did pick up some more of these. I had a viewer contact me on Instagram and she told me that she had looked these up online and on the people that make these three birds design on their website, these retail for six bucks six bucks a piece and they had a ton of these and I'd only picked up one in the past and of course it was the waffles because you know I'm food obsessed so this one is the waffles with the syrup the bacon and the eggs and sorry car <laughs> and um, I'd picked this one up for Kerrigan because she wanted it but when I saw them again I went ahead and picked up two more because these would be perfect to put in a bag for the teachers for end of the school year gifts so this one, of course, is just your breakfast theme. This is your journal, and these are your two post-it notes. And then this one right here is just your two post-its are your heart with polka dots, and then your multicolored star, and then your journal it says, make today amazing. So cute. They did have these and a ton of other things. I think mermaids and unicorns and all that good stuff, but I got these for the teachers at the end of the year. Quincy's running around being crazy. I hope the lighting's okay. I can't get things set out here good because this is my first time recording out here with the new camera. So if you guys have any suggestions, just put them in the comments below. Okay, picked up a candle and this is one of the soy blend candles. And I picked this one up specifically because it's black and the scent isn't that very, you know, I don't like a very strong scent. It's um, just a nice little like lotion-y scent maybe. That's what it reminds me of, some kind of lotion. But it's called River Rock. It looks a little masculine, which is nice because, you know, most of the candles at Dollar Tree are like floral or, you know, girly, girly. Quincy's moves in the camera, of course. But I got this one to put in the office because, again, my colors out there are gray, black, white, silver, black, you know, things like that. So I thought this one would be cute when I film out there and I'll just have it lit. This is the one I got and I've heard that soy blend candles are supposed to burn longer. So I'm excited to test that one out and let you guys know. Okay, I did pick up some of the antibacterial wipes and these are the ready wipes. So it says they're comparable to the wet ones antibacterial wipes. You get 50 in these. They are alcohol free and these are in the fresh scent. These are in a huge container, sort of like the Lysol wipe container or the, what is it, clean and clear, whatever I pick up at Dollar Tree. You just open this up. Oh, they do smell good. And then you just pull them out as you need them. They did have the Dollar Tree brand there also. And in that one, you got 60. Um, it was in a smaller container. So I'm wondering if the wipes were smaller. I think they were. But, you know, this one is more of a name brand. I went ahead and picked this one up. We did not have any of these or any Germex when we were in D.C. the last, what, two weeks ago. And after walking around for six hours in DC and getting back to the car and not having anything to wipe our hands or anything down with, we just felt extremely nasty. So these are gonna go in the side door of the car. So we'll have them anytime we get in and out. Boom, we'll be able to wipe our hands. Anytime we pick up food out, boom, we'll be able to wipe our hands. I hate that nasty feeling. Germex is great, but I would rather have these wipes just so you know, feel like you're getting some of the gunk off your hands. And again, they kill 99.9% .9 of germs. They did have some Mucinex back in, and I think I'd hauled these several videos back. I'd bought two to have here, but look at this weather. If you could see the pollen that is on our vehicles right now, <laughs> you would know why I picked up yet another one. It is definitely allergy and sinus season. So this is the Mucinex Sinus Max. You do get 16 liquid gels in here. They are liquid filled capsules. This is the daytime and it's for ages 12 and up. So it helps, it clears sinus congestion, relieves headache and controls cough. Does have acetaminophen in here too for like fever reducer, pain reliever type thing. These are great. They do not expire until I think the end of summer. So I went ahead and picked up this extra one because Preston is like me. He's my 23 year old or almost 23 year old and he has sinus and allergy issues all the time. So I thought I would just go ahead and pick this one up and throw it in his medicine cabinet at his house. I like to stock him up on medications like this so that when he does need it, he's got it there and only had to pay a dollar instead of running to Walmart and spending $12. These retail for like $12 at Walmart. That's crazy. 
they're starting their display of Mother's Day gifts because you know that holiday is right around the corner. They had in some new coasters and these are the naturally absorbent coasters. They have like the cork board on the back. They had three different kinds. Two of them were more of a farmhouse decor. This one is more of a floral watercolor uh, pattern that's on it and it says best mom ever. I knew when I went back to get them that they probably wouldn't have them so I wanted to go ahead and get one for my mother so that she could put it so that I could put it in my gift bag when I give it to her because I just think it's cute. She sits in a recliner and she's got a little table beside of her like I do of course and I like to have a little coaster to put my drink on when I'm drinking something. They had in this game and it's similar to another game that I'd picked up at Dollar Tree before. I love these little travel games. I call them travel games because they're in these little packets and they have this little zipper seal that's on them. So once you take everything out, you can cram it back in. I'm gonna take this one and I'm gonna put it in the glove compartment of the car. So when we're traveling, we will have it. I have so many things in the back of the driver's seat so that when we are driving around and traveling for like five hours to get to wherever Chris is, there's stuff in there to, so that the kids can, you know, occupy themselves with. Okay, so Briley's 10 and Kerrigan's 17. They still need to be occupied with something other than a phone. So we had scavenger hunts and other games that they played. The bingos, all the travel games from the Dollar Tree are in the car. And this one's going to go in there too. But this one will be more like when we're at Chris's place, wherever he's at, or in the hotel room. And this one is called Say It Again Game. And it includes 12 cards, one game dice, and two mouthpieces. So you'll put the mouthpiece in. It'll sort of distort the way you speak and then you'll say whatever phrase is on the card and the other person has to guess what it is. Definitely something that'll occupy them. I'm not gonna lose all the pieces. I think that's great. And it just says guess the phrase on it. I mean, it's ages six and up. So cute, love these, love, love these. Okay, the last two things that I picked up are food related. I have picked these up before, but I believe it was at Dollar General or Family Dollar, and it was last summer, and Preston and Briley both loved them. I should have got two boxes, but I think Preston liked one and Briley liked the other, so I might just split them up. These are the Sonic Ocean Water and Cherry Limeade Freezer Pops, and there's 10 in here. They are naturally and artificially flavored. We love Sonic Cherry Limeade. It is like one of my favorite things. I do not drink soda often. I haven't had, I couldn't tell you the last time I've had soda. It's been months. But if I'm going to get a soda, it's gonna be a diet cherry limeade with extra cherries. Oh my gosh, I absolutely adore that. So, <laughs> it's gonna be hard for me to say no to these things probably. These were cute, again, when they had them at Family Dollar, Dollar General, whichever one it was, they were only a dollar there too. But this is so good because the heat has finally hit in Tennessee and they love eating popsicles and things like that. Pop, push pops, all that good stuff. So went ahead and picked that up. And then the last thing is keto related. And I'm sad about it, I believe, because this is my favorite keto friendly pizza sauce. I think it's called Francesca or Francisco Rinaldi. And it is a pizza sauce. It is 14 ounces and it says it's made by Italians. But in this one, there's no sugar added. And do you know how hard it is to find like a marinara sauce or a pizza sauce or something that doesn't have sugar added? It is so difficult. So the ingredients in this are tomato puree, salt, extra virgin olive oil, spices, dried garlic, and dried onion. That's it, no added sugar. This one is four total carbs per serving, but if you go by net carbs, it's only three net carbs, which is great for a sauce like this. The problem is, this is the last one I could find at any of my Dollar Trees. They are switching over to a different brand, and guess what? It has sugar. And I use this probably like three times a week or something, maybe more than that. I use it on my pepperoni pizza bake, chicken bake, my zucchini, pizza bites. Um, I use this on so much and I've only got this one and one more. 
I'm so disappointed. So I'm on the search to find some more of these. These are definitely keto friendly and delicious. I'm also so happy that I could do this collab with Elizabeth. Make sure you go check out her Dollar Tree video. It's all about keto and healthy foods at the Dollar Tree. Can you imagine? I'm so excited. I'm really, really excited to see this video and to go ahead and stock up on all those items. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe to me. When you go check out her video, tell her I sent you and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. I'm not sure if he's been running around in the background or not, but he wanted to say hi. <laughs> he wants down so bad he can't take it. All these bird noises and spring and all these smells in the air. He's just freaking out. <gasps> Tell him bye, Quincy. <gasps> Tell him bye. Tell him bye. Say bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Say bye. I's a baby. Really?